Welcome to the Southeast Texas Weather Briefing Daily Update, issued Friday morning, September 5th. Here is a surface map for Saturday morning. Moisture levels are expected to remain high across Southeast Texas for the next several days. The combination of weak disturbances moving into the area from the east and a slow moving frontal boundary moving into the area from the north should produce mainly scattered showers and thunderstorms over the next three days. The best time period will be late night through the early morning hours near the coast and inland during the afternoon. Here is a three day rainfall forecast Friday morning through Monday morning. Rainfall totals through the period should average under a quarter of an inch. Parts of the area could see maybe one to two inch rainfall totals and associated with the stronger storms or any training of storm sets up. Here's the latest two day graphical tropical weather outlook from the National Hurricane Center issued early Friday morning. There is no tropical threat along the upper Texas coast. The only system being monitored at this time is a tropical wave that has moved off the African coast is moving westward and the Hurricane Center is giving a low chance of development over the next couple of days, 20%, and the chance is medium, around 30%, uh, through the next five days. For the daily weather summary, no hazardous weather is expected at this time, no tropical cyclone threat along the upper Texas coast. Three-day rainfall totals should average under around a quarter of an inch. Some spots could see some higher amounts, maybe one to two inches, in association with the stronger storms or where any training sets up and temperatures should be near normal with lows in the mid to upper 70s and highs generally in the 90s. Thank you for listening to the Houston Galveston National Weather Service Briefing.